Welcome back to the news here on this Saturday evening. First alert meteorologist Dave Turley and for meteorologist Dylan Smith. And that's a live view there from our Chatham Parkway Toyota overhead sky cam. We got the camera pointed a little bit more out to the north and uh, northeast of the station here. And that's where we're seeing some of the showers back over into the Garden City area right now. That's really the only shower, so most of us are going to stay dry. That rain chance at 10%, and we're going to keep it drier for our Sunday. So outdoor plans look to be okay. Still going to be hot and muggy, upper 80s to some lower 90s, and we bumped that rain chance up just a bit there on Monday to 30%. Didn't see any rain officially at the airport yet. We'll see if this shower tries to get close to the airport. Uh, we did see a high temperature of 90, and we're still going to keep those temperatures averaging in the 80s. If you're heading out, rain chance only at 10% through that 11 o'clock hour. And as look at that fair and fair first alert live radar, you can see we are basically dry with the exception of that one shower now crossing over the Savannah River, heading over towards Garden City, just about to get into the Clearview area along, uh, looks like Highway 21. And that will continue to make its way down to the south and southwest here, getting over towards the Berwick area. It looks like uh, Isle Hope 727. It might try to clip the eastern areas of that, though. Coffee Bluff 738 and then Richmond Hill by about 748. And that's the only shower we have now. Could still see another isolated shower storm pop up, but we're not expecting any big rain tonight. You see the temperature still holding generally in the mid to a few upper 80s at this uh, 7 o'clock time frame. Cold fronts down to our south, so that's why we're seeing a little bit of that drier weather. High pressure tries to build in from the north. That's going to keep the rain chances lower for our Sunday. So hour by hour showing you relatively quiet there, especially overnight. We'll have a dry start for our Sunday morning and just a slight chance for that shower storm in here uh, for tomorrow. So that's good news. Again, if you have outdoor plans, we got the rain chance at about 20%. High temperatures very similar to today, upper 80s to lower 90s. If you're heading to the beaches, a low risk for rip currents out there. Water temperatures are still extremely warm, about 87 at Tybee and on Hilton Head. Your first alert, 7 day forecast sees those rain chances start to creep back up a little bit on Monday, 30%. Then we peak it here at 50% uh, for Tuesday and Wednesday. Not a big rain threat here next week. It's really more those afternoon uh, sea breeze rain chances, but those temperatures are going to start to warm up. 95 there on Thursday, 95 uh, expected even on Friday, and we'll keep those mid 90s going on into next week.